Hi, today we are going to learn uh, about nominal GDP and real GDP. Uh, before to this, you should understand what is GDP. I made a separate video on this uh, topic GDP. If you are interested, you can go to uh, that video and watch it. Uh, for uh, for to understand this uh, topic nominal and real GDP, I will give a, a little bit of uh, about information on GDP. GDP means what, uh, the total goods and services produced in the country in a one financial year. Financial year, you know, India's financial year starts from March, uh, sorry, April 1st of uh, April 1st to uh, that ends in March 31st of next year. For example, uh, this this year 2023-20, this is the one financial year. It starts from April 1st of the 2023 and ends in March 31st of the 2024. 2024 this is what financial in this period <coughs> what are the what are all the goods means if in this period in between this period what are all the goods and services produced in the country uh, we calculate the GDP by uh, by adding the sum means uh, in terms of money we are adding all the goods prices produced in the country and end up with <coughs> end up with one uh, one uh, big sum that is what we consider GDP. Okay. Then what is about uh, nominal GDP and real GDP? I will explain this by taking the one um, one good means. Let's assume. Let's assume. India produces. India produces only one good let's assume india produces only one good that is steel okay that is steel let's take one year one random year for example 2011 18 at uh, 2017 18 okay this is one financial year in in this financial year india produces only one good that is steel what much amount of it produces it 300 kg of uh, Steel it produced in the in this financial year. What what would be the price of one kg of uh, steel? It is about thirty rupees. Okay, it's about thirty rupees. Three hundred kg and one kg of uh, steel is thirty rupees. It is market price. Market price means it is the price of the steel. What consumer feel? What consumers avail at the market? So it is the end price. Everything it is included. This price includes everything: tax, indirect tax, and production cost. Everything. This is the final price. What it uh, in the market? Okay. So wh then, what is the GDP? GDP of that uh, GDP of the country in, in this year, 2011. So to calculate the, uh, to calculate GDP, we take 300 kg. This is the good. 300 kg into 1 kg 30 rupees so what is the gdp 9000 rupees okay. 9000 rupees is the gdp of the country in this year okay let's take let's take, uh, assume uh, one there is one another year 2011 and 12 here the market price of market price of steel in this year is 20 rupees this is one year i would take i will tell you why i am taking this year the uh, in this year also uh, india produced steel the market price of the steel is 20 rupees in this year here the market price of the steel is 30 rupees why there is a change because of inflation because of increase in the taxes it may be anything anything uh, maybe okay so the there would be change in price uh, you, you know every year the price of uh, um, goods changes it's because of many 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 factors here also the same thing happen happen so now we are calculating for the same year gdp equals <clears throat> what is the amount of uh, steel produced in this year 300 we are taking the price market price this one 20 rupees you will understand this is 20 rupees 
what would be the GDP? Six thousand. Okay. So now see. Here, this is also the GDP of this year. This is also the GDP of this year. But there is a little dif difference. This is nominal GDP. This is real GDP. What's the difference? You will see. We are for nominal GDP. We are taking the goods produced in the year 2011-18. And the market price of that year only, market price of 2011-18. This is the difference actually. We are here taking the same amount of goods and sir, goods produced in the produced in the country. That is 2011-17-18. The produced good is 300 kg. We are for calculating real GDP. We are taking same good, same amount of good, but we are taking the 20 rupees. Why? That is what real GDP. We are taking the 20 rupees. That is the market price. This is also the market price of the state, but for uh, but of the different year. That is market price of 2011-20. It is 20 rupees. This is the difference. Nominal, nominal and real GDP. Market. We are taking the market for one. We are taking the market price of the current year. For other market price of the another year, this year we call base year. Every uh, every time uh, the government changes the uh, base year price. Uh, last time it is about uh, two thousand uh, four and five, I think. Why why we are taking the base price? Because because to calculate uh, what is the rise. For example, twenty rupees. Uh, in the 2011 uh, for uh, now it is uh, in the 2018 uh, 1780 it is 31 to what is the uh, inflation we uh, to know the inflation to know the how much is the tax increase for that we are calculating we are using this base year price okay that's all this is what the nominal uh, gdp and real gdp